Hey, hi! Welcome back to the series of automotive sessions. I am Thorta Krishna Hema, your automotive expert. So, today's topic is ABS, an anti-lock braking system. So, this video is made as a part of Mashmoto short videos. Let us get into the topic in further more slides. ABS, anti-lock braking system, is anti-skid braking system. It operates by preventing the wheels from completely locking up. The ABS system includes speed sensors which are attached to all the wheels of a vehicle. When the sensor detects the wheel is about to lock up, a modulator unit partially releases the brake pad on that vehicle, on that particular wheel. In this way, uh, the wheels will be allowed to spin uh, intermittently during braking, some anti-lock anti braking can apply or release brake, braking pressure 15 times per second. So this enables the driver to steer the vehicle even during braking also. So which helps the car not to collide with the obstacle in the straight path of the vehicle or not to fall into the pit or valley in the straight way of the vehicle. So... I just wanted to explain it in other terminology in terms of hydraulic pressure. So ABS is an ECU which has a microcontroller in it and which monitors the rotational speed or the speed sensors it will have with all of its all of the vehicle wheels. Okay. If it detects a if the speed sensor detects a the detects this wheel rotating significantly slower than the speed of the vehicle it actuates the valves to reduce the hydraulic pressure to the affected wheel thus the wheel runs faster similarly if the wheel runs faster than vehicle speed it decreases the hydraulic pressure and slows so it increases the hydraulic pressure and slows down the wheel with ABS equipped cars, it is practically impossible to lock even during panic braking in extreme conditions. It helps the car not to skid and hit something or fall into something. With this, I have completed my topic. If you like this concept, click on the like button. If you want further more automotive videos, subscribe to my channel. Thank you.